Hey guys, it's Lisa. Welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be me giving you an update on my older child, his curriculum that we're using for math. This is something that I've been telling you guys I'm going to do, but I wanted to test out the new curriculum that we decided to utilize for a while before I gave my honest review and before I told you guys about it. I wanted to make sure that I really liked it. You guys know how I am. I know that sometimes we select, or it seems as if sometimes we're interested in curriculum because it seems like it's what's popular and I wanted to make sure that this wasn't the reason that I was selecting this specific curriculum to use for math. I wanted to kind of feel it out and make sure that it wasn't just the hype of something new and something exciting was the reason why I was selecting this curriculum. So we have had this curriculum since November. We started using it exclusively in January. So November we got it we kind of dabbled in it here and there. We already had a curriculum that we were using, but we made the switch over to this curriculum because it seemed to fit his needs a little bit better. So my 13 year old, like most, is into gaming and he likes to be online, he likes computers, he's interested in all of that. And so we have switched over to teaching textbooks. I have to thank Teaching Textbook for sponsoring today's video. Now I will say, although they presented this opportunity for us and we are very blessed and very grateful for it, it was up to me as a homeschool mom who is in control of our home to say yes or no. And if this did not fit in our curriculum, it would have been an easy pass for me. I am someone who thinks very long and very hard before I make a transition like this, a big leap like this for my family. So. You guys know that I was, at the end of the year, I was looking for something new in math because it wasn't working just for this, you know, for my older child. Our previous math, he was bored with, he didn't feel like it was challenging, it was not engaging enough. There was a lot of uh, repetition in that curriculum and so we started to look and then I remember that I received this information from teaching textbooks and I'm like, okay, fine, let's give it a try. And so we gave it a go and he loves it. He loves it. I love it. It is in an online platform. So if you do not have access to a computer or an iPad or a phone of some sort, I don't know if you would want to do that on the phone, but if you don't have access to the internet or if you have poor service, that can be a little bit challenging. You know, you do need an, a working online access to internet. So that's something to, to take into consideration. So teaching textbooks is an online curriculum for homeschooling students where it takes the hard part out for the parent. I know that when I first brought him home, my fear was that I wasn't going to know enough information to be able to teach it to him. And teaching textbooks just pulled all that fear away for me as a mom because they grade his work for him, they teach him everything, they have lessons, they give him hints, they have the quizzes, the quizzes are graded. I get to preview the grade book, like everything is taken out for me, his lessons are there in order, he knows exactly where to go what platform it is it's very easy to access and initially when we got started he just took a placement test and then I was able to slide him into the level that you know that he needed to be in for his age his level his knowledge all of that I'm sorry they have a lecture that they would watch and read through and then they go ahead and do the lesson and the lesson is explaining to them how things are done while they're going through the lesson so then they do their lesson and then a couple lessons later, they have a quiz. Another thing that I really enjoy about teaching textbooks is that it is affordable. It's an affordable program. If you guys look it up, you can see how affordable it really is. I'm not just saying that to you because I am affiliated with them at all. It is affordable. I am telling you that. It is very affordable. I've looked into so many different curriculums, so many different options, and I am telling you, if you are even a little bit interested, check out the price and see how much it is. They also provide tutors. So their kid is surrounded with support. I always say that it takes an entire village to raise a child. One child, whole village. So imagine those of us that have more than one. I have three little ones. It is hard sometimes to maneuver through each different kid and transition through each different kid. So any help that I can get for them, I take it. I seriously will take any help that I can get. So with them offering tutoring, if your child needs it, they will take a phone call. When I initially downloaded this program, I was having a little bit of trouble because I wasn't completely understanding what to do because it was all brand new to me. I sent a quick email, they responded and said, we can call you now. 
and got me all set up. It was amazing. From my research, it is the only math curriculum where it grades for the parents. I have three kids and any time that I can get back is a blessing. So the fact that it will grade his work for me, I know it's accurate. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, when he was going in and we were using another curriculum, I would have stacks of papers that I needed to grade because I was trying to focus on each kid individually and trying to wear all the hats as a mom, a nurse. I feel like I'm a nurse. I'm not a nurse by trade, but a chef. And we have a dog and making sure my husband is okay, making sure our house is running smoothly, making sure everybody gets every single thing that they need. If I could take one thing off the table, grading their work and having everything all ready to go and they know instantly what grades they're getting, that was huge. Textbooks is that it has a built-in system called safety nets where the kids will, or your student will get like hints, they'll get a second chance, they'll get hints, um, they'll get a step-by-step -step instruction on how to complete uh, the work. I like that a lot because, I mean, Cameron is in seventh grade. Some things that he does is honestly over my head and I can try to explain it for him. I can try to look up YouTube videos and try to figure things out. But if there is a system out there that has everything laid out in front of me, like what, why not? <laughs> why, why wouldn't I want that information? Um, they have a tutoring hotline. If your child is struggling, there's also a video is explaining every single problem that your student has. There is a video for every problem. Like that blows my mind. How did they, how did they do that? How did they create a video for every single problem? It's awesome. Like it is amazing. I love homeschooling in general because I like to go at my own pace. I like to know that my kid is retaining the information, not just doing the work. And so if I find an area that I feel like they're struggling in or he's struggling in, I will you know, pump the brakes and I will go back and try to figure out what other resources are available for him so I don't have to go pull out all of these other books. I mean, if I want to, I can, but I don't have to because teaching textbook makes it so easy for me to have access to additional resources. When I first started seeing videos about teaching textbooks, it did make me want to go online and do research and see what others were saying about the program. And one thing that I saw that seemed pretty consistent is that once someone starts with teaching textbooks, they continue it on through high school. I love that. I love consistency. I love seeing that people were genuinely interested in it and that it was actually working in their home, especially with middle schoolers and beyond, because that's where it gets like serious. And I know from experience having, you know, a kindergarten or preschool and then having, you know, a middle school child, it is a completely different ball field and you definitely have to be on your A game and you have to be prepared. So just seeing that they stuck with it that long made me want to try it even more. And now that we're there, I can see why. I thought that because it was an online platform, it would be confusing, but it is not. It is very simple. There is a student portal and then there is a parent portal and you can unlock and lock things, turn things on and off. You could turn on the grade or on the lessons and off the lessons. You can say, okay, I want you to only complete one lesson at a time or I want you to complete two lessons at a time or three lessons at a time. Cameron's is open to three lessons at a time. That's the most that he would do at a time, but he only has to do two a day. It also gives you live grading. So if you take a test and you know your grade drops a little bit, it'll show you that right away. It'll give you your grade average always right there where you stand at that moment in class. So I like that because sometimes he would ask like, where, what's my grade, where am I? And I would have to you know, tell him like, you know what, I gotta grade a few things and I'll let you know. But because the grading is immediately, everything is updated right away. So I did mention that it has hints. One important thing about having hints is that the kids don't, ha they can work more independently. They have hints built in every single grade. So it allows them to work more independently so that there's less questions that they would have for you. I can tell you my seventh grader very rarely has questions for me. Very rarely because everything he needs is right there in front of him. I feel like it's really setting him up to be successful. He has always been an independent learner. Even when he was in public school, he would get frustrated if kids were slowing down time because he knew the information and he wanted to continue. So I like that we're able to control his pace. He's able con to control his pace. He's able to con control his learning and that works well for our family. So teaching textbook 
4.0 has been built so that it can work with any um, device that you have. You can have access, the same access on your phone. There's plenty of times where Cameron is at the table and I'm sitting right here on the couch in the front room and I'm looking through his grades while he's working. I'm asking him, what lesson are you on? And then I'm going there and I'm looking at it as well. Therefore, if he has a question for me about something, if he does ever need me, which doesn't really happen, I am there and I can provide assistance just off of being on my phone while he is on the computer. We do have a MacBook. We also have um, an HP laptop. We have iPhones. We have iPads. We have a Chromebook. So we have a bunch of different um, electronic devices to utilize and we have had zero issues with any of them. There are different things that you would utilize to download, like for the MacBook, you would, you know, click on this box and you would download that app. For your phone, you would download this. But it gives you all of that information. It says click here to download this, click here to download this if you're using this device or whatever. So I like that it's very, um, they're very helpful. Uh, the, the Okay, so two more things that I want to mention for you guys and then I'm going to be done because I can talk about this curriculum forever because I love it. I love it. I'm not just saying that. No, I truly love it because I feel like it's given me back so much time. Every moment in homeschooling is important. If you are a homeschooling mom or throughout this pandemic, if you've been doing lessons at home, you can definitely agree with me. I am sure that every minute in homeschooling is important. Um, in this platform, you are emailed. If you choose to be, you are emailed your student's progress every day. So you can always be in the know and understand where your student is and what they've done. That way you can plan for, okay, maybe we need to take a step back and revisit a lesson the next day or whatever the case is. I like being in the know with my child's information. It's like I have another teacher in class who cares about my kid and who is helping me through this process. I love it. He doesn't spend all day in math. He gets there, we get to the point, and then we get out. We log off and we move on with the next lesson. I like that he can just come up, set his things up. He doesn't dread doing math. We used to dread doing math. He does not dread doing math. He comes in, he opens up the laptop, he gets his math done, and he's done. And it's not a process where he's like, oh, I don't feel like doing this. I don't want to do this. Can I do this later? Because trust me, I have heard it all. He does not do that anymore. He knows exactly what he has to do for the day, and he gets it done, and then we move on with life. We move on with the next lesson or whatever else we need to do. And that was key for me because I know my child's personality type. He's a visual learner, and he likes to get to the point. And so this definitely gets him to the point so that we can continue on with our day. Oh, I also wanted to mention that they have, I thought was just cool and extra. If you have younger kids, my kid is not so much into this, but if you have younger kids, they have like stickers and animations and you know, the certificates and all of that. They have all of that fun stuff. Again, my 13 year old, not so much interested in it, but they do have stickers and things like that. In conclusion, to end this off, I am telling you guys from my heart that I love teaching textbooks. I love it even more because my child enjoys it and that is what is most important to me. That is what is key to me. Um, I mentioned earlier that sometimes we kind of are swayed or inspired maybe I should say because it's popular and it's what we're seeing now. I am telling you from my experience that I love it and I don't know what I would be doing without it because if you guys were following me, you know that I was having a very difficult time last year at the end of the year with my teenager and math was just not, it was, it was looking rough. <laughs> it was looking rough and I was ready to like pump the brakes on math for a little while until I found something and here we have it and it has changed everything for me, everything for my homeschool, and I really, really hope you guys can um, have an opportunity to check it out. I will have a link to teaching textbooks in the description box below because I truly want you guys to figure it out on your own. See if you are enjoying it on your own. I really think you will, but I want you to just check it out. That's all you have to do is just to see if you like. We will see if, I'll see if there's any way that I can get a free trial for some of you guys as well. If I can, of course, I will leave it in the description box below so that you can check it out as well. But I hope that this video was helpful. I will be going over 
um, the remainder of our curriculum and what we're using for Cameron as well, as well as our curriculum for next year, because guess what? I have it already. I have already gotten our curriculum for next year. I am all set and prepared. There's a couple other things that I'm waiting for, but I am happy that I feel like um, I found our, our safety net in homeschooling. I found, I figured out what what each of my kids enjoy, their learning style, what they're liking. So I'm excited to roll out that curriculum uh, to you guys for next year. So make sure you guys stay tuned. Homeschooling with my teenager who is back there on the computer. What that looks like as far as him using teaching textbooks. I love you guys so much. And until next time, I hope you guys take care and have a wonderful day. Bye.